Good day everyone, today I will be discussing with you the SSS congruence postulate or the SSS postulate. SSS stands for side, side, side in a triangle. So the, the postulate states that if three sides of one triangle are congruent to the three corresponding sides of another triangle, the triangles are congruent. So let's say we have our triangle. Let's say we have this triangle. We're going to name it as triangle A B, C, and let us draw another triangle. Then I will name it D, E, F. Okay. Now to check using the SSS postulate. Let us find first the corresponding sides of the triangles. So the corresponding sides are AC corresponds to DF. DF. And we know that AB corresponds to E, F, and B, C corresponds to D, E. Now, if this is the case, we can say that A, C is congruent to D, F, and A, B, segment A, B, is congruent to segment E F and segment B C is congruent to segment D E. Therefore, if that is the case, we can say that triangle A B C is congruent to triangle D E F. That is, using the SSS postulate, or the side, side, side postulate. Now let's have a series of examples and exercises to better understand this side, side, side postulate. Now let's have our exercises and examples. Write all the congruent sides in each pair of triangles and prove that the triangles are congruent. So we have our number one and number two. First, let us answer our number one problem. So we have a triangle KLM and triangle NOP. We're going to write all the congruent sides. So let's start with our symbol. KL is congruent to OP. Next, second, KM is congruent to NP. And last, LM is congruent to NO. These are the congruent parts of our triangle or the congruent sides in a triangle, in our triangles. Now, prove that the triangle are congruent. So, triangle KLM is congruent to triangle NOP by SSS postulate. So the, true the two triangles are congruent 
by SSS postulate. Now, for number two, we have here two triangles, triangle ABC and triangle BCD. Write all the congruent signs. Let's start with our first. First side is AB is congruent to BD. Second, our given AC is congruent to CD. So using the SSS postulate, we need three sides. So we know that by res uh, reflexive property of congruence, reflexive property of congruence, BC is congruent to BC. Now we have three sides, first side, second side, and third side. We can now conclude that triangle ABC is congruent to triangle BCD B, C, D, by SSS postulate. Okay. Now, try to answer your exercises in your module. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV.